All right, guys, I've uh, got Susie with us here today, and Susie is a, one of our rock star students. Susie is crushing it with wholesale selling on Amazon, and she's got a, uh, a training that we're putting together. It's going to be coming up next week, and I'll have the link there below so you guys can register. And uh, Susie, how are you doing? I'm doing great. Good. How good are you doing? You. <laughs> yeah, good. So um, explain, uh, you know, normally, what kind of sales are you normally doing with uh, wholesale? How does that work? Well, we were doing about fifty to sixty thousand a month. Yeah. And and then we got hit by this right. stay at home coronavirus thing and it dropped right. to twenty eight thousand in yeah. the last thirty days. So yeah. I was kind of pinched a little because of how much money we have in inventory, our capital. Right. But we're we're doing okay. Yeah. So now that the um the restrictions have been lifted, are you been able to get that, that same product back into the warehouse? Some. We can't ship all of it back in, but we've been able to ship some of it in and sales have definitely picked up. So they're back up to around uh, between 1,500 and 2,500 a day. Oh, nice, nice. And what kind of, people always say, oh, that's great, you know, as far as sales, but like, what is that equivalent to as far as profit margin goes? Uh, our profit margin is generally around 20%. Oh, nice, so 20%, awesome. Uh -huh. Now, what are the, you know, I get a lot of people that tell me, you know, they, they get hit with an arbitrage, for example, they get hit with IP complaints and, you know, with getting an IP complaint, you know, you've got to fight it by sending them a receipt. And sometimes that's not always, you know, like they're not always so accepting of a receipt. Right. And right. Uh, so, so what's, what's the advantage of like wholesale, for example? Well, sometimes I, you're less, well, you're less likely to get hit by IP complaints in the first place, but you still can. And when you do, it's easier to fight it because as long as you, your wholesaler knows that you're selling on Amazon and all of my vendors know that we sell on Amazon, we get the invoice. Sometimes I can't find the invoice, so I go to my, my <laughs> wholesaler, hey, can, I've got a, a suspected IP complaint. Could you hit me a, um, an invoice? And they're happy to well, then i can send the invoice over occasionally amazon is not so happy about that so then i send them a letter from our vendor and they've been happy to provide us with letters that give us approval to send their to sell their brand on amazon and then we've been whitelisted on different brands yeah that's nice that's nice and then the other thing too like sometimes people come to us and they say you know i get I can only buy so many, right? They go to Target or the Walmart, right? And they can only buy so many, and then sometimes they get blocked. Like I've I've been, you know, blocked, for example, from selling, mm -hmm. buying at Target, and I've seen other people do that as well because they buy too much of a right. Product. But you don't run into that, do you? Right, and that's part of one. I and mean, we knew right off the bat that we wanted to go wholesale, but when we were doing mostly all OE and RA, that's one of the the um, the points, the pain points that pushed us over the edge when <clears throat> we had more and more capital. So we started buying more products and then we started getting blocked from different stores. Then it was okay. They don't want us to spend money. So we went to wholesalers and they were like, go ahead and place as big orders as you want. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. So that's, that's super nice. Yeah, it's very difficult to scale if you're limited on how much money you can invest in product. Right, exactly, exactly. Well, um, awesome, Susie. Well, thanks for taking the time for this quick uh, video. So uh, we're gonna have a training we're gonna be having next week and I'll have the, the link there below. Um, I'm not gonna set the exact dates because this might be a evergreen video, we will see. <laughs> um, but uh, in that, inside that video, Susie and I are gonna be, you know, just kind of going in depth and, and all of this, so you guys get a real training on how this works and how you can use this for your business and what Susie's doing differently that's allowing her to, you know, grab these accounts and be able to scale. And when she does get IP complaints, she's able to remove them pretty easily. You know, all the things that, uh, that we're gonna be talking about inside that video. So uh, if that sounds good to you guys, uh, click that link there below, register. Um, this may or may not be recorded. So, you know, we have limited availability as well. So we may, you know, take this down. This may become a paid training. So you definitely want to show up at the live training. Okay. Uh, any last thoughts, Susie? Well, I do want to mention that 
my daughter is is working the business with me and that makes a big difference i don't want to take all the credit it is yeah that's right i, I forgot to mention her. yeah <laughs> yeah cuz your daughter is able to you know you you're able to work with her as well i mean you've got a full time uh uh side or you know full time basically business that you have going on so it's because of your daughter that you're able to do this right because you're able to partner with her yes and i've been able to pr uh, pay her um for the most part full time wages at least the last few months so it's been nice to be able to provide that income for someone. Yeah, that's nice. That's nice. So she, um, does she have kids of her own? No. Oh, okay. So she's, but she's able to work from home then and, and set her own hours and schedule. And, and yes, you know, that's one that that's the beauty of what you've been able yes. to provide for. Yes. That's awesome. It's that's been awesome. great. That's awesome. Well, maybe, uh, maybe we can swing it though. She could come on the, uh, on the training on Tuesday, on the next week as well. Yeah. I think that would be great. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, guys. Well, if that sounds good to you, we'll look forward to seeing you guys then. Register. Uh, we'll see you guys at the event. Look forward to seeing you.